All right, so now that we've done um, our first progression of the circle drill, which was our pre-planned version, we're now going to go to our second progression, which is unplanned. So we're going to add in the element of the foam roller drop. So what's going to happen, I'll give MC uh, the get set and the go. She's going to run as fast as she can around the circle. I'll be at a random cone ready to drop the foam roller. Wherever I drop the foam roller, it's either going to be a drop right or a drop left. So what she's going to have to do is react to the direction of the foam roller and make a drop step to retreat backwards and keep going around the circle. All right, MC, let's see it. So get set. Go! Good. There it is. Good job. So she had to drop left that time. That was awesome. So biggest thing, we want to make sure that the athlete is sprinting all the way to us. We want this to be an aggressive sprint. Like they're going to feel like they're about to run into us. When we make that drop of the foam roller, we want to see them actually be set in their hips and making that drop step nice and low versus popping out of the drop step. 